got our cap. Man, there's just smokes everywhere in this whole facility, right? Holy crow. Ah! Stop it! Where are you? Whoa. I swear to God. Green blobs flying at ya. Oh nice, I can repair the sonic emitter with the plasma pistol. Hazmat pod security code. Pre-war money. Oh, sorry. Duct tape, handy. Bottle cap. I'm gonna have to use some right away in a second here. I'm almost at stage one radiation poisoning. So that's neat. <gasps> Yay! Swim packs. Scrap electronics. <laughs> Steam gauge? No, I don't need that. Um, bottle cap and pre war money. This time it's three bottle caps and a carton of smokes. Yeah, I've already been in that desk. <laughs> okay. Why is there just a set of stairs here that don't really do anything? Sick with minor rad poisoning. Off out with a locker. Five bottle caps. Where's my right away? I only have eight? Oh, jeez. jump and even if I can, is it worth it? The 
this jump I can make. <laughs> Back to the terminal. Requisition order chemical suits. Got word today there's a chemical leak at the Sierra Madre. Oh god. <laughs> Sierra Madre, really? Uh, Sinclair was on the phone to ask for more help from the think tank Zex, so they're sending in the prototype chemical suits to protect the dealer workers. Looks like they're following up on an experiment with another experiment. The whole process creeps me out in the way they're monitoring the Sierra Madre Vila and examining the results. I don't think Sinclair even knows what he's really paid for. To be guineas like the little Yangtze Chinese, maybe be merciful if war did break out putting an end to this chain of horrors. Oh, okay. That kind of ties some things together. All those walking ghost people at Sierra Madre. All those suits that they have, they were made here. That's kind of... That's just kind of neat, the way they just tie everything together. Um, might as well try this jump. Huh, damn it! Nope. Ah, fail. Um, got some smokes out of the deal, though. Uh, <laughs> Try one more time. Just hit the jump button a little too late. Put the gun away so I can get a better run at it. Jump! Oh, nice, I made it. Wrench. Actually, no, I need a wrench for the weapon repair kit. The weapon repair kit. Little box. Some vodka. Greasy toolbox. Uh, nope, none of that. Screw you guys, I'm going home. Huh. Okay, so what's with the uh, pod code thing I got? Things I don't understand. Corrosive glove. Where the hell did you come from? In all seriousness, where the hell did you come from? Does he have a Gauss rifle? He has a Gauss rifle, doesn't he? Friggin... Stop moving! I hope my life really hard. You don't even have a helmet. so I can repair my one gauss rifle with my other one, so that's cool. I don't have to worry about using that lair thing to repair it. There's for a second, 411. Yeah, no, it's really strong, but it's just, it takes forever to fire it <laughs> and reload it. You only get like one shot, so... Yeah, anyways. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Smokes. Free radical perk. What is the free radical perk? You gain enhanced effects from right away. Awesome.
I don't know what it was doing before, but now I got Rad's minus 144. So that's pretty much like a full uh, notch down, because like every level's like 150 Rad's, right? Um, yeah, about that. 150. Maybe 175, I don't know. Oh, whatever. It's handy regardless. So let's just move on. Cigarettes. Crack the cigarettes. Pay war money. No idea where I'm going. Ah, frag. Again with the. Oh, Jesus. I like completing these little mini challenges for the extra experience. That's and now he runs. serious. Oh, it was fun. <laughs> oh, I see a big X13 sign up ahead. Hex Crate Archipelago. What? Hmm. X13 right there, so maybe that's the front door. Awesome. Oh, well, there's like a little path and everything. That's cute. Alright, you know what? Actually, I think I'm gonna stop there. And, uh, why am I still moving? Yeah, now we'll stop there, and next time when we pick it up, we will enter the X13 research facility. Thank you for watching. Have a pleasant evening.